fighting raged in Gaza nearly five weeks after Hamas's shock October 7 attack triggered a furious response from Israel aimed at destroying the Islamist militant group. About 1,200 people, mostly civilians, were killed in Israel in the attack, according to Israeli officials. Israel faced growing calls to protect civilians in Gaza as its battle with Hamas encircled the territory's main hospital, where an aid agency described the situation as catastrophic. In Gaza, upwards of 11,000 people, also mostly civilians, have been killed in the war, the health ministry in the Hamas-run Palestinian territory has said. Israel revised down the death toll from last month's Hamas attacks in southern Israel from 1,400 to about 1,200, according to a foreign ministry spokesman. A deadly strike hit Gaza's largest hospital compound, the facility's director and local authorities said. Gaza's Hamas government reported a toll of 13 dead, while Al-Shifa hospital director Mohammed Abu Salmiya blamed Israeli forces for the strike at the facility sheltering people from the fighting. Around 50 people were killed in strikes that hit a Gaza city school and their bodies were taken to the Al-Shifa hospital, the facility's director said. The World Health Organization warned that the health system in Gaza is on its knees amid the fighting, pointing to hospital corridors crammed with the injured, the sick, the dying, as well as tens of thousands of displaced people sheltering.